This message was brought to you by Carrier Skate Shop. I can't look. I can't. I can't look over and see you. YouTube. It's your main man Quintro Vines here. You know how I do. Today we have uh, a legendary piece. Brian Shima Colts here. If you can believe that. After 20 years they have re-released the Shimas. Let's just see what we got here because I'm pretty excited about this box. I got this one actually from the Carrier Skate Shop. Shout out to them. You know what I'm saying? Got it. First things first. They come in a bag. Just not a nice bag like the God Skates. You know, for starters, they got the old school Razors logo on the back. My favorite part for sure is definitely gonna be these these white accents. This is this is what I think a lot of people remember. Oh man, hell yeah. Oh man, waiting all day. Can't believe this. Brian Sheen after 20 years. Sheesh. What? Oh man, you, you tripping right now. No way. No way. You know, 20 years ago this thing came out and it was the hottest thing in the streets. Every single person wanted a pair of these or had a pair of these. Just really brought back a lot of cool memories to think about when this video was when I started skating and when I saw these skates to now here they are again. Man. 60 millimeter ground control wheels. I believe these are 98 hardness. And so, but they put eight of them on a feather light frame. What? Now, guys, this is a little bit dangerous. This might get some of y'all hurt because uh, that is not what we rocking these days. But one thing I know that I would do personally is just take these two middle wheels out and throw some anti rock So you know, if you're doing airs and big jumps and spins and stuff like that, that might be cool for the eight wheels down. But if you're just trying to do your normal grinds, especially if you want to do a lot of cool switch ups and stuff like that, be careful with these, man, because this is a, this is screaming out a lot of wheel bite liner here. I mean, it seems a little bit different than the original here. You can see it, the S H I M A. You can see it going around there. I'm surprised that this liner does seem to be kind of legit. And these are our older model skates, so it still has that old look and that old feel with the smaller sole plates. They still work just as great. I mean, there's no way around that. They are incredible skates and super lightweight. Um, the backslide plate looks real nice, but you also got to remember, since these are a little bit smaller pieces, these pieces do tend to go pretty fast. Um, especially if you do like set slides or you know if you get out in the streets a lot you're going to be replacing your parts um, probably a lot faster it still responds and still skates just as great this is going to be your legendary boot you know that this is going to be one of those skates that you probably buy one pair two pair two pair because you want to have one pair to actually skate and then you want to have one pair that you're literally going to put on the shelf shima was not on the razors team for a good maybe 10 or 11 years the last company that shima was writing for was this was the last time we saw shima skating shima was skating on his own brand of skates these are just incredible this is going to make a lot of older people get back into skating so these are going to probably sell out pretty damn quick this is an old head skate for all the older people out there who is like man i miss my skating days and this and that this is what's going to get them to crawl up out of their bed dust their old knees off and get back to skating ah! but yeah he signed the whole front side and then i got the rest of the gang on the back I ain't gonna lie, you know, I got some murders in there, some Dre Pals, you know, a little something, something. Shout out to Carrier Skate Shop, man, for hooking it up with your boy. You know how they do, they hold me down. Go copy a pair of these, man. Holla at Carrier Skate Shop.